Thanks, Kelsey. It is just two nights until music's biggest night, the Grammy Awards. But this year, the Recording Academy is surrounded by controversy. News Channel 5's Jessica Newton has details on what the former CEO claims happened behind closed doors and what one Grammy nominee thinks about it. Rock and roll is forever. The Grammy Awards. It's a show that every musician dreams to be a part of and an award that means more than any other. I am fortunate enough to be a five-time Grammy-nominated artist. Lynn Marie started playing polka music when she was just 11 years old and later moved to Nashville where Chet Atkins encouraged her to bring polka to the masses. Nobody ever says, oh, I polkaed once and I hated it. It's fun, happy music. It makes people happy. Her album released in the year 2000 earned her a Grammy nomination and the honor of being the first woman ever to be nominated for Best Polka Album. But Lynn Marie's album released the following year was not nominated. She inquired why and what the head of the voting committee said shocked her. He made it clear that he personally did not think I deserved even my first nomination. And he made it very clear that he had a mentor-protege relationship with someone else that was nominated. The Grammys are about voting. That's also what former CEO Deborah Dugan has alleged. In addition to sexual harassment and gender bias in the Recording Academy, she said the voting process is illustrative of the boys club mentality and that sometimes artists who are nominated or their friends are in the room and they're allowed to vote for their own interests and sway others. It's something that Lynn Marie hasn't been in the room for, but something she hopes will change if true. I'm a woman. I try to make great music. Do I feel like at times it's not appreciated as much as a man's probably? Is that the way it is? Yeah. Is my job just to continue to create great music? Yeah. Regardless of the situation, she says the majority of Recording Academy members are incredible musicians and will always be an honor to be considered for a Grammy. I get choked up because um, it kind of makes me feel like I did something good that people appreciated and recognized. Jesse Knudsen, News Channel 5. The Recording Academy denies Deborah Dugan's allegations, including the allegations that the voting process is unfair or rigged.